Good morning, you guys. Good afternoon to some of you who may be on East Coast or whatnot. Uh, but it is still morning here in beautiful Colorado Springs. Uh, welcome to our Masters 25 break. This is honestly probably the fastest filling break uh, that I've put up, which is surprising, honestly. Uh, really surprising. Uh, I figured most of the people that did the voting inside of my poll just voted because that's what they want to see opened. Like, they didn't take in mind, like, the question was what, like, technically, like, what would you buy into? You know, what seems interesting? That's what I was going for. But, I mean, I wasn't too clear on that. Uh, don't mind me, you guys. I am working on getting everybody tagged. Just as soon as Facebook wants to wakey-wakey. All right, got Shane in here. Um, see Morgan Britton, got you in here. Koi, getting you in here. And then Chris. What up, Morgan? What's up, dude? Good morning. All right. All right, we got a couple people in here. We are gonna go ahead and just switch over to the randomizer. So here we are. We're just gonna go ahead and get this party started. Rolling a seven. We'll take that. We'll roll a seven. All right, come on, last round. Oh, Chris and Shane, bo both with the double stacks. Okay. Okay. We will take that in a heartbeat. All right. Bam. There we go. Got the link in there. I mean... What else do we do except for get the break started? Let me go ahead and crack this box open. There is 24 packs to this box. So like the post says, six spots, four packs a piece. I'm hoping to hit foil Jace. If I'm being real with you guys, last time I opened Masters 25 booster packs was actually when I opened up a booster box of Masters 25 and my wife and I opened up foil and non-foil Jace the Mind Sculptor. And this was a couple years ago. We just tried it just for gets and shiggles, you know. Alright. Now, get in the middle, grab the edge. All right, remember six spots, four packs. So, here we go. Good luck to each and every one of you guys. I hope you all pull fire. Right, last two stacks right here. Without further ado, let's get this party started. Going over to Morgan. Once again, good luck to each and every one of you. Let's all pu let's pull fire today, you guys. Come on, let's go. Let's get it. Just for nostalgia state nostalgia sake, I'm gonna just go through a couple of these packs. Not the first couple, but like maybe one per person. We got a ruthless ripper, trumpet blast, 
Dragon's Eye Savants, Echoing Courage, Skirt Commando, Pacifism, one of my favorite uh, arts at least, A Phyrexian Ghoul, Ghost Ship, Disenchant, a lull, it's supposed to be LOL. <laughs> Into the Uncommons, we got a Zoetic Cavern, Invigorate, Genju of the Spires. First rare of the day is an Azusa Lost But Seeking. That's actually a pretty solid hit right there. Play two additional lands on each of your turns. That's wild. So that's already a pretty solid hit right there with a Foil Lull and a Morph Token. Pack number two. Come on, Jace. I mean, there's still plenty of stuff in the set, so. All right, skipping through your commons. Got a Stang. I got Stang. Swiftfoot Boots. A Willbender. Rare number two is a Pernicious Deed. A Pernicious Deed, however you want to say it. Pretty sweet one. Uh, X, sacrifice it, destroy each artifact, creature, and enchantment with converted mana cost X or less. That is a fun card. A foil fiend hunter and kobolds of Kerr Keep token. Let's get it. I don't know if y'all can hear the background noise, but kind of listen to some magic being played. All right. Listen to CGB do his thing. We got a regrowth. I'm not gonna lie for a sec, I thought it said murder of cows. Willow the Wisp. Next rare is a Living Wish. Two drop sorcerer. You may choose a creature or land card you own from outside the game. Reveal that card and put it into your hand and exile Living Wish. And then a foil invigorate with a wolf token. All right, come on. Last pack right here. Yeah, this was probably the luckiest booster box of... Oh, no, not the luckiest. I pulled... Um, I had a really good Throne of Eldraine booster box. This is definitely a close second, but I had a really good Throne of Eldraine. Back when the Showcase Brazen Bar of Foil was 180 bucks, Pulled that with, like, three... Um, like, two Planeswalkers that were borderless. It was sweet. Watch Wolf. Invigorate again. A Browbeat followed by... A Mystic Snake, your four drop, two blue, green, and one. Flash, whenever the ETB's counter target spell. So a creature counter. That's a uh, pretty sweet one. Come on now, Josh. You know what to do. We got a Foil Squadron Hawk and Kobolds of Kirkheap Token. And that's set for stack one. Not a bad stack. Uh, going on to stack two and three over to Chris. All right, let's get it. Going on. All go remember i'm going through the first pack for each individual person so i'll be going through four packs total got act of treason savannah lions dusk legion zealot thresher lizard shoreline ranger anox survivalist haunted fengraf a man o war path of peace prophetic prism when this is foil beautiful into the uncommons, we got Goblin War Drums, creatures you control have menace. Genju of the Spires, Ordeal of Heliod. Come on, first rare, Triscade Kaphobia. This one's a, a fun one. Four drop of at the beginning of your upkeep, choose one. Each player with exactly 13 life loses the game, then each player gains one life. Uh, each player with exactly 13 life loses the game, then each player loses a life. Pretty solid. Well, fun. I wouldn't say solid, but fun. 
Death's Head Buzzard, and a Morph Token. Keeping it going. Honestly, if we don't pull a JTMS in here, I might just post up another Masters 25. I'd love to see a Jace today. We're going to skip through your commons now. A Dark Ritual. We got a Core Firewalker, Mesmeric Fiend, Utopia Sprawl, ah, and to a Hell's Caretaker, 4 drop, black and 3, horror 1-1. One, one. Tap, sacrifice creature, return target creature card from your graveyard to the battlefield. Activate this ability only during your upkeep. Hey, there we go. Foil, little foil brainstorm right there with a skeleton token. Skipping through the commons. Come on, Jace. Come on. Valor and Akros. Urbis Protector. Merfolk Looter. Into a Darien King of Zeldor. Keldor. Six drop three three. Whenever you're dealt damage, you may create that many one one white soldier creature tokens. That's pretty cool. Vampire Lacerator Foil with a Soldier Token. Probably for Darien. Keeping it going. Alright, skip it through the commons. A Brood Hatch Nantuko. Shadow Mage Infiltrator. Myriad Landscape. Oh. Chalice of the Void, here we go. First Mythic of the Day, Chalice of the Void. Nice. Going over to Chris, congrats. A Foil Unearth and a Spirit Token. Nice, Chalice in the stack. Azusa. All right, Azusa, show us Jace. Isan's Shade. I had to figure out how to say that real quick. Cloud Blazer. Quicksand. Into a Strionic Resonator 2 drop. Artifact. Pay 2 and tap it. Copy target triggered ability you control. You may choose new targets for the copy. Foil Ghost Ship and a Stang Twin. Got that Stang. Skipping through the commons. We got a Twisted Image, Ash Barons, Fallen Angel, into a Conflux. This is your 8 drop, Wooberg and 3. Sorcery. Search your library for a white card, a blue card, a black card, a red card, and a green card. Reveal those cards and put them into your hand, then shuffle your library. Woo! That's a paragraph to read right there. Shoreline Ranger Foil with a Spirit. Right. Skip through the commons. You've got Spike Shot Goblin, Treasure Keeper, Boros Charm. Nice. Mythic Rare Tree of Redemption. Four drop, green and three. It's not an expensive card, um, but strong. Defender 013. You can tap and exchange your life total with Tree of Redemption's Toughness. There we go. Old Storm card right here. Soul Bright Flamekin. And a beautiful Angel Token. Yes, sir. All right. We got an Exclude, Evil Mori of the Open Fist, Iron Shaman, and Chris, your last rare of the day, 
is a Rorik Thar the Unbowed, six drop green red four, six six with vigilance and reach. And it attacks each combat of Fable. And whenever a player casts a non creature spell, Rurik Thar deals six damage to that player. This card is nuts. I've seen it used in Commander so much. Like, if you're playing green and red, you should probably have that in there. Elvish Aberration Foil and a Goblin Token. But what a sweet stack, you guys, going out to Chris. Pretty sick. Two Mythics in the stack. Chalice of the Void being the big one. Triskaidekaphobia. That's gnarly. All right, stack four going over to Koi. There we go. Let's get it, Koi. All right, Ruthless Ripper, Chartooth Cougar, Act of Heroism, Diabolic Edict, Phantasmal Bear, Plummet, Skeletonize, a Fathom Seer, Geist of the Moors, Assembly Worker, and to the Uncommons we've got a Regrowth, Willow the Wisp, Rancor, into an is it chemister three drop goblin wizard one three with haste pay a mountain tap it exile target instant or sorcery card from your graveyard pay two red one and tap it sacrifice is it chemistry cast any number of cards exile with is it chemistry without paying their mana cost that sounds like that could be a fun card haven't ever seen it played but looks like it'd be fun active heroism foil and a soldier token Seems really good if it's played correctly, too. Just go Jund. Get stuff into, like, your graveyard. Use that. That'd be sweet. All right. Got a Goblin War Drums. Another Rancor. Humble Defector. Into a Coalition Relic. Three drop artifact, tap at one mana of any color to your mana pool, tap it, put a charge counter on it. At the beginning of your pre combat main phase, remove all charge counters from Coalition Relic, add one mana of any color to your mana pool for each charge counter removed this way. Seems like a cool little mana rock. For three, though. Four drop, choking tether, spoil, and a morph. Come on, come on, pack three. Yeah. Right, through the commons. We got a twisted image. Quick silver dagger. Sigh of the Shinobi. Into an Eidolon of the Great Revel. Two drops, spirit, two, two. Whenever a player casts a spell with converted mana cost three or less, it deals two damage to that player. Wow, I like some of these cards. Spell punishment. That's a pretty sweet looking insect token, though. I'll give that. That's pretty gnarly looking. Right. Last pack for you, Koi. Skipping through the commons. Valor and Akros. Murder of Cows. Lore Scale Codal. And to it. Oh, this is actually a really good card. Vendillion Click. Uh, three drop, two blue, and one. Mythic Rare. It's a fairy wizard, 3-1 flash flyer. Uh, when it ETBs, look at target player's hand. You may choose a non-land card from it. If you do, that player reveals the chosen card, puts it on the bottom of his or her library, then draws a card. So it's like it's a friendly, get this out of your hand type thing. So that's actually a pretty sweet card to pull, so congrats on that. Vessel of Nascency and Elf Warrior. Usually like a two of and like an Azorius control deck for modern. At least from what I've seen. Not bad at all. Not bad for your first Master 25 break, Koi. 
Didn't get that Jace, but it's all good. Here we are. Of course, Koi. Going on to stack five and six. Over to Shane. Shane will jump right in today. There we go. All right. Let's get it, you guys. All right, for nostalgia's sake, reading the fourth pack. Soul Bright Flamekin, Loyal Sentry, Vampire Lacerator, Mog Flunkies, Presence of Gond, A Brainstorm, that's sweet, Path of Peace, Prophetic Prism, Dark Ritual, Colossal Dread Maul, yo, the rarest one out there. It's a joke if you don't hear the sarcasm. Because they reprint it a lot. <laughs> Into the Uncommons, we got Isan's Shade, Ordeal of Heliod, Brian Elemental. Into a Vesuvian Shapeshifter. Five drop, two blue, and three zero zero Shapeshifter. Whenever the ETBs are his turn face up, you can choose another uh, creature on the battlefield. If you do until if you do until Vesuvian Shapeshifter is turned face down, it becomes a copy of that creature and gains at the beginning of your upkeep. You may turn this creature face down and morph. Four two, and then a foil blue elemental blast. And an elf warrior token. Moving on. Let's go, Jace. Give me a Jace. Skipping through the commons. Watch Wolf. Herbus Protector. Genju of the Falls into a Flooded Grove. There we go. You can tap and add a colorless, or you can pay a green or a blue and tap and add green, 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 blue, or blue, blue to your mana pool. What? There we go. Thalia, Guardian of Thraben, Foil, Human Soldier, uh, two ones, the two drop, white and one. First strike, non-creature spells cost one more to cast. Control Hater... And an angel token. That's sweet. Thalia. Guardian of Thraven. Hollow foil. Pretty card. Actually, let me check something real quick. I think that card is actually worth something. Thalia. Guardian of three, man. Yes, sir. 13 bucks for that. That was a good hit for sure. All right. Oromancer. Supernatural Stamina. Soul Bright Flamekin. Don't know why I'm going through them again, but let's just have fun with it. Loyal Sentry. Arcane Denial, Plummet, Retraction Helix, Another Dark Ritual, Wild Heart Invoker, Frenzied Goblin, and we got a Mistress Factory, Nyx Fleece Ram, Freed from the Real. This is a wicked art like art to this card. Into a Ball Lightning 3 drop, Red, 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 6 1 Elemental, Trample and Haste, the beginning of the end step, Sacrifice it. Pretty good card. Heavy Arbalest Hollow Foil and a Goblin Token. All right, back through the commons. A Curiosity, yes, sir. Lightning Bolt, Promise of Bunray, and our rare is another Thalia, Guardian of Thraben. There we go. And a Foil, God's Willing. Take that with a Fish Token. Alright, 
skipping through the commons. Ancient Craving, Quick sl Silver Dagger, Sigh of the Shinobi. Here we go, Master of the Wild Hunt, your four drop Mythic Rare Human Shaman 3-3. Three, three. Uh, at the beginning of your upkeep, you create a 2-2 two -two wolf creature. You can tap it and tap all untapped wolf creatures you control. Each wolf tapped this way deals damage equal to its power to target creature. That creature deals damage equal to its power divided as its controller chooses among any number of those wolves. That's pretty sweet right there. A foil act of treason and a beautiful angel token again. Last three packs here. Come on, Jace. Let's see you, buddy. Let's see ya. Alright. We got Enthralling Victor, Core Firewalker, Caustic Tar, and to a Rugged Prairie, our second one. Second land of the day. Does the same thing, but with red and white. Uh, tap it to colorless, or you can pay a mountain or plains and tap it and add mountain, 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 plains, or plains, plains. Then you got a skirt, commando foil, and a morph token. All right, come on now. Show us Jace. Show us Jace. My second, second favorite plains, or technically my third favorite. My first is definitely Teferi, second is definitely Lily, and then third is Jace. Zombify, Pyroclasm, Corona's Zealot, into a Reform, okay, one of the common rares, but that's, that's a okay. This box has been pretty sweet so far. Trumpet Blast and a Kraken. You know what? This box is pretty good. I think I'm a, I'll am do another Masters 25 tomorrow. Why not? Have some fun with it. Get the commons out the way. We got Mishra's Factory. Ravenous Chupacabra. Really good card. Utopia Sprawl. Alright, last rare of the day, you guys. For Masters 25. A Nikor Bolas. There we go. Mythic rare. Eight drop. Uh -huh. Red, red, black, black, blue, blue, two. Um, not mythic rare. Seven, seven flyer. At the beginning of your upkeep, sacrifice Nikor Bolas unless you play uh, Island Swamp Mountain. Whenever it deals damage to an opponent, that player discards his or her hand. That is solid. That's solid. Foil, Mesmeric Fiend, and an Insect Token. All right, you guys. That was a uh, pretty sweet Master 25 break. Like I said, I have not opened up Master 25 in a couple years now. Um, so definitely had some fun. Got to open some sweet stuff. Double Thalias, one being Foil. Oh, wow. The Flooded Grove and Rugged Prairie both went to Shane. Two Thalias, Vesuvian Shapeshifter, Nickel Bolas, this was actually just a pretty sweet break overall. Uh, I appreciate you guys, and I uh, hope you guys have a fantastic rest of your day. Uh, thank you so much. You're all awesome. Have an even better week. Until next time.